and Vinlik, Kirby Game & Watch. Yeah, this is a matchup that um, right off the bat seems like it'd be really rough for Kirby. Oh, yeah. Mainly because Absolutely. Um, Kirby does not struggle when it comes to having a good moveset, but mm -hmm. struggles when it comes to mobility. Exactly. And I think Game & Watch is one of those characters that can absolutely stay there, camp, and yes. also get out of combos really well. Yeah, it's, I'm really glad you mentioned that, too, because it's, it's, not, it's the mobility plus the fact that Kirby is just so... Scrawny. He has like a, a lot of basic buttons, as I like to put it. And Game Watch has a lot of very fun buttons, so we'll be seeing a lot of uh, you know high APM gameplay. Game Watch abusing all of his tools, you know, already opening up pretty strong here, 89% as opposed to 30. Yeah, right off the bat we saw uh, like two down smashes being thrown out by Gutbuster. <laughs> this is the reality of Kirby does not have the speed yeah, to punish that. Exactly. You know? So there's there's pretty lo little reason for Gutbuster to not be throwing these out. You know, Game and Watch is like going by a frame by frame, and Kirby is like, I have the move, I just have to put it out and commit. <laughs> Game and Watch is you know. <laughs> I like that from Vinelink right there. Actually, using like the one disjoint Kirby has in that up. Um, yeah, up very right there. smart actually. Yeah, and we'll see. We see. We see some walking right here. Very good gameplay by Vinlick. Walking is a tool where you don't see it too much, but when you do, it's kind of a treat. It's very awesome to see. I love walking in this game. Yeah, it, it shows that the opponent's thinking about their position. <laughs> it shows that they're thinking, and yeah. that we enjoy. Yeah, that, that, that's so, rare sometimes. Over here to the ledge trap. Let's see. Not going to find it. Gutbuster are going to find the parry into F tilt. Interesting, interesting. And this is big. Down throw Nair. Maybe a... I was gonna say maybe a hammer because I do I do know that we do see like some of the cheesy game watch players go for the down throw nair yeah, hammer. <laughs> it, it's like as one much nine, like a meme as it is. There's there's pretty little reason to not go it, for it. With it's the not lead. bad. It's yeah. a one in nine chance for your opponent to explode. And Gutbuster gonna be living here. One thirty one. Not gonna find V up smash on the neutral tech or neutral get up. Excuse me. Yeah, Good if you're Gutbuster right now. I mean, there's really no reason to initiate anything, you know, like that, like those that yeah. dash attacks, the only way you're going to lose the stock, you mm -hmm. know? So but it was good awareness. I was actually just about to touch on that, that Kirby got the buffed up throw, uh, you know, able to find those kills, especially with PS2 platforms, which is nice. There you go. See, like, you see you see Kirby trying to play the game, <laughs> and, game away, uh, and hold the chair. <laughs> I just imagine, like, that SpongeBob meme where, like, SpongeBob runs out into the trash can and throws a chair and just boonks him in the head. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> So here we go, yeah. Vin like an entire stock down now. Gonna have to make something happen. Yeah, and the more I think about it, the more awful this matchup becomes in my head. No, you're see like you're seeing it, yeah, right? Yeah. You can't touch Game to Watch's shield. You have to deal with huge hitboxes, and then you just get combo to infinity because Kirby's a combo character, and, and the, you're dead. The one saving grace <laughs> Kirby has, a really good combo game, just is it doesn't out the work window. on him. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, by wow. Like, Gonna have to do some soul searching to, to gonna, win this match. Maybe I like you say that because dare I say he reaches into the pocket, or maybe he reaches into the Red Bull machine. You know, powers himself up a little bit. Yeah. Shout out the Red Bull. Please sponsor us. Please sponsor us. <laughs> so, yeah, Cutbuster pretty comfortable. I mean, we were talking about it a little bit before we hopped on the mic that he is new, he's new to the game. Sure, he's also pretty new to Game and Watch. Luckily for him, Game and Watch does kind of reward. The creative mind. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, we'll, we'll put it that way. We'll yeah, that yeah, way. yeah. Uh, shout out to Gutbuster, though. Man's the GOAT. <laughs> Every time I see him, he comes in, we dap up. It's just, just like, shout out to Zeno, too. Zeno's got a lot of really awesome homies. Yeah, for sure. Um, but yeah, so, yeah, we see why the matchup is so difficult. Game & Watch, you know, hard character to keep up with. It's not like Kirby has, like, a long-range tool, like a Young Link arrow or, like, a Zero Suit Zair. He's, he's just playing nooch. But what we could see, too, is... I haven't really seen it too much. We haven't seen it last game where Kirby has the inhale ability and could maybe use that tool against Game & Watch. Yeah, because that's pretty much the only way you could like call out Game & Watch's shield is with a command grab because yeah. Kirby does not have the range to like touch it and knock it up beat, exactly. like, right out right there. I was also just saying in terms of having the Game & Watch chef ability where he could oh, do some stuff for like, yeah, that, put him at ledge. That could be fun. That could be really fun. I'm not to mention Kirby... <laughs> Kirby becomes racist, so, I mean... Yeah, uh, <laughs> that's one way to put it. Oh, oh wow. That can kill. Yeah, Very that was really early. good reaction to the trip, too. Almost losing his stock at 79. Nice back air. Here we go. All right, Vanlik finally finding some footing here. Nice oh. spacing, And wow. that's so huge because we saw last game, the first stock was pretty even, and then Gutbuster closed it out and just kind of ran away with the lead yeah, because exactly. it was really hard for Kirby to initiate it. And but now Vinelik does not have that pressure. We're, we're seeing something different, right? Where Vinelik has the lead, and now Gutbuster has to change the way he's playing this game. Let's see. But he's not going to change it. Still looking for down smash at ledge. Pretty pog. 
Here we go. And using those jumps, actually, you can get around the like um, brigade yeah, of up airs a little bit bears. better. But just the fact that Game Watch is able to have the upper there is just such a good tool for him too. Good dash attack. Here we go. Yeah. And the the counter pick here was Smashville. Um, it's weird because you would think this would be an auto ban. You just want to run away from Kirby, but I mean, uh, then again, I'm not the Game Watch player. I just observe. So. Yeah, it, it. I mean, I wonder what else. Maybe they banned like small battlefield and Yoshi's or something. But actually, Game Watch does like Yoshi's. Towson. Oh, oh wow. Yes. Okay, so they banned the big, they banned stages I thought they were gonna go to. Funny enough. Good yeah. Fair. Oh, that nine. Is that a nine? Yeah. Oh, I thought that was a taunt for a second. Here we go. Oh, that was really cool. That was kind of kind of cute. Drag yeah. down fair jab. Kirby has a lot off of fair with both drag down and Ooh. fair one stuff. Yeah, and you see right there, he avoided the trump through holding in, and wow, what a tech chase. Yeah, with, with Kirby's speed, that's not a reaction. Dude. You gotta soul read that. Yeah. <laughs> it's weird because Kirby is like, we're, we're ripping on Kirby this whole time, but he's he's like decently fast on the ground, has solid tilts, but like we've been saying, you compare it to a character like Game Watch, in theory, this should be impossible. Up he had a shield, there you go. Every time he should do that. Every yeah, single time. But um, as I mentioned, uh, Violent was going to have to do some soul searching. I will say he has switched up his gameplay a lot. Yeah. And one thing I've been seeing particularly is usage of a B. It can call out yes. the fair by uh -huh. putting out a hitbox. Exactly. And it's a disjoint that can contest Game Watch. Exactly. Things. And like you said, like Game or Kirby does not have too much of those. The fact that he's even abusing it is uh, actually really interesting to see. See, like sometimes he will opt to land on stage. Other times he'll be like, okay, I don't want to commit. I go to ledge. Please! <laughs> I want to see it so bad! Yeah, it, it's one of my favorite Kirby's. <laughs> it's awesome. Oh, yeah, and that's like... That's a few times now where Vinlick has been, you know, looking for a smash attack at Legend. Not really finding it! Good F tilt to cover the uh, neutral getup attack. Here yeah. we go, off stage. Landing Huge. that dare on Game Watch seems next to impossible. Yeah, let alone it also seems like he's gonna make it back every time. Wow, what, what a, a brave F tilt. Yeah, brave for sure. And here we go. Yeah, every time Kirby gets knocked up in the air, he has to play this disadvantage so carefully. Wow. I didn't know that was a I didn't know that was a thing. That yeah, was interesting. I, I wonder if Vine Link was trying to jump away and just did not have the speed to. Okay, and both these players here baiting their breath. Gutbuster knows this is his game to lose. Vinlick, <laughs> if he can complete this, I mean not gonna find it. Yeah, and this is this is the thing though. It's closing out the stock. That's like the final battle. That is yeah. gonna be tough for Game Watch. Bro. No platform. Not gonna find it. Not enough rage either. Here we go. You see him looking for the F tilt because he knows it'll kill. Off. Uh, no pummels. And it lands Maybe? on the platform. Yeah, there that's we go. it. Okay. Yeah, and there we see the Smashville platform coming in clutch. Gonna make it a one-one set here in what seems to be like a matchup where in theory you never lose. But, you know, we're at the level, I think like most people are in this venue, where it's like, matchups matter, but does it really matter yeah. compared to a player versus player? You I, know? I agree, especially when um, Vinlink was able to make those adaptations, like, yes. no matter what matchup you're saw showing, them. you're showing um, how, like, your smarts as a player. That being said, um... I think Gutbuster needs to realize what kind of stage he wants as a Game & Watch. You know, banning Town and Kalos yeah. last time, I think he's I not too aware of the game one. plan he should go with. You know, <laughs> I think you gotta be campy. That's listen, how you bro, Kirby. if that was me, if I just, like, played Game & Watch, right, I'm just gonna take him to the big stage and mash fair backwards. Yeah, <laughs> and, and that's what like, you what should else do. what else would I do? I'm gonna mash fair backwards, I'm gonna mash up the shield, and I'm gonna mash downer afterwards. Three buttons, bro. PS2 now. That is a that pretty big stage. Too, yeah, you know? that's pretty big. Yeah, and like, yeah, and it was pretty dominant here, game one too. So, uh, I mean, oh my God. Okay, this is a wow. 50, 54 and counting. Yeah, that was clean. That that's was like dope. The first like good <laughs> like big long Kirby string we've seen yeah, so far. Yeah, because Kirby has these strings, but on a character like Game and Watch, where he can just get to you know mash out of these uh, options and stuff. We haven't seen it too. We haven't seen it too much. Not at all. Yeah, but Game Watch can get that percent right back with this <laughs> up there and there. Yeah, Game Watch does not care about you or your advantage. Why? Because he's Game Watch. He's just an enigma, baby. Uh oh. You gotta be hitting these timings if yeah. you're gonna go for these down smashes so much. That it is a tough timing. I here. don't know if many people saw, but Cupbuster <laughs> definitely showing some signs of tilt in the player cam. Ooh. You know, like railing back, being like, ugh. That was safe. <laughs> yeah, and you really can't have that because your game plan is to camp, and if you're, you can't camp while tilted wow. for the most part. You gotta stay composed. Yeah. 
Uh, okay, here we go. That was a really good fair. If we, if we could see more of those, then, I mean, in theory, then, Gutbuster should be able to take this, but now, <laughs> like, like, just like game two, he has to fight from behind. Yeah, Gutbuster, kind of letting Kirby mash a bit too much, you yeah. know? You have the disjoints and the up B to deal with it, but um, a lot of just, like, empty full hops and such. It, exactly. And I love how you mentioned that, too, because it's like, you can let Kirby just mash there because you're playing Game & Watch. Like, there we go. Okay, that's what we have to see. Keep it simple. But we haven't really gotten a chance to talk about Vinlick too much. I mean, Vinlick is just... He's so good at just playing the basic game plan here. Everything seems to be connecting and working in his favor. Now right, here we go. If Gutbuster can close out the stock, though, before a Kirby combo, it's going to be huge. Dude, and like you mentioned, those up Bs are just paying such good dividend for Vinlick. Wow, he caught him mashing out of hitstone, baby. That was hype. I love those kind of scenarios, man, where it's like so small and intricate, but it's so simple. Yeah, it, it shows that you knew exactly where Game Watch was going to be, you know, which is just really huge. good for momentum. And now huge. 60%. Here we go. <laughs> Give him the chair, the chair, baby. Oh, and got a one right there. So now it's 74. <laughs> and that's oh, a dead game. Oh, that was watch. so clean. He spaced fair on his block, knew he wanted to grab, and S smashed his face. Let's go. Yeah, and this right here, it looks really rough because I feel like Up Buster is like kind of getting less and less patient as the game goes yes, on. Yes, exactly. And Vinlick's just taking full advantage of that. <laughs> I think Vinlick heard me, man. He wants me to see the, the, the Black Kirby. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Nice. So what do you have to say about this position right here? I mean, like, like we saw game game two, like, we have a whole stock lead. Uh-oh. Yeah, I mean, it's up to Vinlick to avoid, basically, any, like, Things that Game Watch is classically fish for, you know, like up smash yeah, or down smash. Exactly. Because that's but, yeah, the only way you really not can gonna lose. find it. And that was clean. Vinlick showing up. Wow. Yeah, yeah, that that showed some skill, you know, that, that to like I, totally change your gameplay like that from game one to you game know, three. Never in my career would I have thought I'd be on mic with you saying Kirby Game Watch could look hype. <laughs> yeah, but I think... But good gameplay is hype. Good gameplay is hype. Good gameplay is hype. But, and I think Kirby is a, is a character that can be really entertaining in the right hands because of like exactly. how like unique their combo game is. And they just have a lot of things going for them that you don't see on other and characters. And listen, we've, we've seen, you know, Kirby's over in Japan putting in work. They think the character's pretty solid. Uh, overall, has like a decent matchup spread. Like, like we were saying, Game & Watch, probably not the most comfortable pick. But again, Vinlick is just putting in the work.